we're gonna go ice skating today. There's a big ice rink right across from my building. We're gonna go there today and check it out. I'm bundled up, it's quite cold in Canada. It's about uh, six degrees tonight. So there's a big blob of ice there. It's pretty normal here in Canada. All right guys, we are here at the ice rink. Let me give you guys a peek of what we do in Canada during winter time. You need something to do. Can't stay in all the time, it's boring, right? So even if it's cold, we try to come out and make the best of what God has given us in this cold country. That's my building over there. I live in that condo. And right across, we have the ice rink here beneath this beautiful clock tower and you can bring your own skates or you can rent them the rental booth is over there I'll give you a sneak peek later but yeah you can bring your own skates or you can rent them and just go around and around in circles and enjoy look at this guy I would have skated today but I have a bruised leg <laughs> um, I bruised my leg on the treadmill, so I think I'm going to give it a rest today. I wanted to, I came with the intention of skating, but I don't want to be bedridden for the next two days. So today we're just going to watch and show you what this is all about. Let's have, let's have a closer look at these Christmas decorations. Pretty magical. And it's cold. Oh my god. There's families, there's kids, friends, couples. Anybody can join in. Look at that cute little girl. She's doing her best to escape. Her sister. This is where you can sit when, when you want to take a break, when you want to relax after skating. We got these little boots here. You can just chill there. It looks quite busy. Like all the tables are full. All the tables are full. Nothing's empty, to be honest. So this booth is where you can rent skates. They go by the hour. Uh, and uh, it says over here, adults is 15 bucks. 15 dollars for adults. And for kids, it's 10 bucks. So you can rent skates, you can get them by your size. And then you can just return them later on. Right over there. You have these little skates for kids. They're like a... Uh, <laughs> They're like an old man, uh, you know, stretcher thing that old people use. Because kids don't know how to skate, so it's quite safe for them to use these. And uh, look at this guy go, wow. They got like milkshakes and waffles and ice cream and crepes. All wintry stuff right here on the uh, food truck here, so you can buy that if you're hungry. You will be hungry, of course, after skating because it's pure cardio. I can't imagine not being hungry after one hour of skating. It's a pretty uh, cool vibe, very romantic. I think um, pre-Christmas, right now November. It's romantic, it's festive, you know, like, and it's a Sunday today, so it's quite nice to see people out and about. Look at these kids go. Some of these kids are professional. That's what we do in Canada, right? It's a cold country, we get snow. So kids know how to skate from a young age. No problem at all.
Guys, it's really, really cold today. They say it's six degrees, but it actually feels like minus six. I'm wearing my winter jacket right now. And I think I should put the hoodie up because it's very cold. My ears are starting to pop. I can't feel my ears, so I have to put up the hoodie. But yeah, that was it, guys. I hope you, uh, hope you enjoyed. All right, guys, we're gonna go now to the uh, mall. It's a square one mall. It's quite busy because it's pre-Christmas season. Everybody's out on a Sunday shopping. There's pre-Christmas sales going on. Everybody's out just buying stuff today. So it's quite busy. I'm sure if you're watching this in Asia, this is not busy for you because Asian malls are hella busy, especially in Thailand. If you're watching this from Thailand or Philippines or somewhere else like Indonesia, you're probably thinking, what this guy is talking about? This isn't busy, there's very less people. Well, for Canadian standards, this is very busy, trust me. <laughs> Here's some of the uh, Christmas decorations here. They got some Christmas decorations going on. You can have pictures taken with Santa Claus. Those are the prices here. And I'll show you Santa Claus. Santa Claus is over there, sitting over there. See? That is Santa Claus waiting for customers for pictures. That's a pretty neat house. I mean, with the crazy housing prices in Canada, I think I should move in there. <laughs> and that's free gingerbread I can eat all day. So guys, I was away for uh, almost three months traveling and uh, it's kind of feeling weird to be back in Canada. It's cold. I really miss Asia, I have to say. Asia is my favorite, favorite continent in the world. But uh, now I'm in Canada, so let's make the most of this winter. Usually I don't like to stay around for winter. I like to go to warmer climates, but this is, uh, I think, after three years, I would say that I'm spending a winter in Canada. It's been long. Long overdue. I need to uh, buy some groceries. I'm going to Walmart. 
comment below if you know what Walmart is. I don't think they have it in Asia. Walmart is a, it's a big staple store here in uh, Canada and the US. So let's go to Walmart, get some groceries so I can start cooking at home. Every time I see luggages, I just want to hop back on a plane and run away. Look at this bouquet of flowers, guys. $25 just for these bouquets. Small, just small bouquets. I imagine, I remember back in Thailand, when I was in Thailand, you can get a bouquet of flowers like this for like 50 baht, which is $2. And we're here in Canada, $25. That's how ridiculously expensive Canada is now after the pandemic, inflation, cost of living is just crazy. <laughs> this is a funny shirt. Nice, naughty, I tried. <laughs> Happy Grinchmas! In Canada, this flavor of Lay's tomato tango is very popular. It's our favorite flavor. You'll find this everywhere. Tomato potato chips. I've never seen them anywhere else. This flavor I've never seen anywhere else in the world. Only in Canada. Because we love tomato. Tomato chips. Alright, we got our groceries for the week. And off we go back home. Alright guys, thanks for watching. I'm gonna go home now and make some dinner. Really hungry. Uh, Christmas time in Canada is definitely a very festive season. There's hustle, there's bustle, there's energy everywhere. It's a bit cold in Canada, so your love, if you show your love by smashing that like button, that subscribe button, it would really, really help and uh, warm me up.